Question 16 states which expression is equivalent to 6x to the power of 8 times y squared plus 12x squared y squared. What you're going to do here is you're going to look for common factors that you can pull out of each of these. So as we can see, we have y squared in both of them. We also have 6 and 12, which we can pull out of 6 from 12. We also have x to the power of 8 and x squared. Okay, so the way that we're going to do this is we're going to pull 6 out, we're going to pull x squared out, and we're going to pull y squared out. Now, we still have to multiply, get this equation still. Okay, so what do we have to multiply by here? Well, we're going to need x to the power of 6 still to get to that x to the power of 8. Keep in mind that this x squared times this x to the 6 is what's going to give us x to the power of 8. We're still going to have that y squared and we have that 6 out front. So now we have our first term. Now, we know that we also have to have another term because we have 6 here, but we have 12 up here. Okay, so to get to that 12 there, we're going to have to add 2, and we still have x squared and y squared here as well. So we see that we're ultimately going to end up with 6x squared y squared times x to the power of 6 plus 2, which we see is going to be answer choice C.